Yo, what's up guys, Adam the Beast here, and welcome back to another video here on my channel. So today I've got something a little different for you. As you can tell, it's going to be a quiz video about JoJo, because I'm pretty much a JoJo YouTuber at this point. This time, the quiz is more about my personality than it is about my general knowledge of JoJo. So this video, I'm going to find out what my ideal stand would be if I was in JoJo Universe. And real quick, before I open the video, I just want to say, if you are a JoJo fan, and you want to prove it to me, make sure to subscribe. and leave a like as well you know and yeah if you want to try the quiz before i do it go down below the first link will be a link to the quiz if you want to have a go first so see what the um see what the questions are and yeah without further ado make sure you sit down grab a drink and cue the intro Yo, what's up guys, and we welcome back to another video. Today I'm doing another JoJo quiz, but this one, as you can tell by the title and thumbnail, is a little, a little different from the previous one. So, recently I've been um, doing these quizzes and I've been testing my knowledge of the JoJo franchise, but this time we're doing something more, more personal, you know? We're doing my personality and seeing what kind of JoJo sound I would have if I was in the world of JoJo. So yeah, let's let's do this quiz. I'm gonna try and do it as honestly as possible and kind of explain my reasoning so it's not a two-second video. We're not, we're not making any of shorts, not on this anyway. But yes, what is your stand? Um first question, what kind of pass I can give you in a piece? Um Well I can't cook to save my life. Road trips, I don't like going in cars very often because I do get classic sometimes. Not not, not often. Very rare, but like sometimes if I'm like eating a lot and I'm in a car, it's like, blah, 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 you know. Fixing broken things at home, well, I can't fix stuff either. So, Jake, I'm gonna care for you, buddy. I like snacks, so what snack do I enjoy the most? Ooh. Right. So, ice cream. It's all the choice, you know, I like ice cream. Chocolate pudding. I mean, pudding's not really an English thing, but I guess, like, if you just mean, like, chocolate cake, then yeah, that's pretty good. Donuts, the ones with all of them. Yeah, but then hearty noodle soup. Right now, I do have noodles in front of me, but they're not soup, which is, like, a bowl, bowl of instant noodles. I don't know, I wish, like, crisp was option here, or, like, chips, depending on if you're English or American. I know some of you guys watching are American, but yeah. I'm more of a savory guy, like, by a lot, so, yeah, but... I have all these. I go for some cake, some chocolate cake, or chocolate pudding, I guess, sure. Are you willing to solve problems with violence? Uh... Where's the pens? I'm gonna say... no. <laughs> you run into a crook who wants to fight you. You? A crook, so they're like a villainous villain. I'm not going to tell Jake it's time for the next meal, because I don't want Jake to get hurt, because I'm, I'm, I don't want that. I'm going to try and... I'm going to try and reason with peace something past me, because I don't like violence unless, you know, it has to go down. If it has to go down, then I'll, I'll do it. But if it doesn't have to go down that way, then, you know, I'll have mercy on their behalf. Anyway, which battle cry would you prefer? Now, I'm always... I'm always a fan of Muda Muda Muda. I, I know Jotaro is like the main character everything, but I am a big fan of the Muda Muda. I'm, I'm a huge fan of the seven page Muda and stuff. So yeah, definitely a Muda Muda guy. Uh, picture of my favorite color. Well, that's obviously violet. I don't actually know if you guys noticed, but my favorite color is purple. I don't think I've explained this in a video, but like, you know, you know, on Windows you can have like the theme color, and the normal one's like white, I think. It seems I've spotted a couple of enemy stand users. A lot of you guys watching aren't subscribed. As you see by this graph, there a lot of you guys aren't subscribed. If you don't want to be an enemy stand user and you want to join the B zone, make sure you go down below, click the subscribe button, and ring that bell. Because once we get to 5k, if we do, I'm going to upload the first episode of Lily Strange Quest. It's basically a Metopia playthrough, but Jojo fight. Jo jo Jojo fight? Yeah, that's a thing. Basically, the Strange Quest is Metopia playthrough with the main character being called Lily. And I'm gonna make it into I guess a JoJo style adventure series. So yeah, make sure to subscribe if you want to see that. And let's get back to your video. 
My, mine's purple. Mine's always been purple. Ever since I got this computer, it's been purple. Uh, what else do I have that's purple? Uh, my my Galaxy Art is down down here. The color theme is like on the on the buttons is, is purple. There's not really much purple in my room, but I, I do love purple. <laughs> Take my word for it, guys. Trust me, I like purple. Are you good with animals? Uh, yeah. I like animals, and animals, I guess, like me. I remember one time I was sitting around, uh, we were going to a friend's house for like, I think it was New Year's Eve or something, or just like a party thing. I have a cat. I'm not a huge fan of cats, but this cat kind of just sat on my lap for the whole time. So I was just kind of sitting there just playing, I think I was playing on my Switch. I don't know if it's the full Switch. I was playing something, probably on the Switch, and they just kind of sat on my lap the whole time. Anyway, which stand paramount per parameter is the most important? Um, persistence. Persistence. Actually, I don't know. I think a power is a very good one because, like, oh, I don't know. These, these all kind of you kind of need all of them in a stand. That's why some stands stuck in stuck in JoJo. They go persistence. You know, if they, if they give up like me, then you know it's not going to be a good stand. I don't know. That's what that's why that's what I feel like anyway. That's why I feel is like the most optimal. Uh, in combat, do you prefer close or long range? Uh, oh god, I think it kind of depends on the combat. Like if I'm fighting a certain enemy in a game, like they have good to be ranged. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna say mainly close range just because I have a katana like in front of me right here. And if I didn't have a katana, then you know I can't really throw a katana at someone. That's not very right hype. Well, that's kind of hype, but close range. What does your default expression look like? Well, if you want to see that, check out any of my reaction videos. Um, definitely a stern poker face. I kind of said that like it's the half time. Like if, if you watch my reaction videos, when I'm analyzing something important, I just kind of like stare like this, like, and that's definitely a poker face. If you had a time machine, what period would you visit? Um. Uh, could die very easily. Not so likely to die. Die even easier. You know, groovy 70s, sure. Why not? Your favorite catchphrase is keep rolling, peace. No, is that not one? Out of these ones? Uh, not really that, because I don't really care how my hair looks too often. As you can probably tell by it looking cringe right now. But what we want, Awaken My Master, pretty good. I, Adam the Beast, have a dream. I'm gonna have to go with that actually. That's, that sounds kind of good. Like, I and the beast have a dream. Like, me going yada yada does they make me feel like an absolute weeb. Awaken my masters. I don't have any masters to awaken. And I don't swear, so. I and the beast have a dream. I think it's a lot. Oh, there we go. We figured it out. My stand is Crazy Diamond. Like many close range stands, Crazy Diamond is skilled in competent, committed physical violence. What sets it apart, however, is its uncanny ability to repair objects through a gentle ca caress. It reflects, it reflects its user, Josuke, who is brutal to his foes and tender to his friends and loved ones. I mean, I guess that's my stand then. I mean, I didn't, I don't know how many stands are in this thing. Like, does it say like how many options there are or anything? But no. But there you go. That is, that is my stand. I am. Josuke Higashikata, user of Cra Crazy Diamond, or if you're if you watch the localization, Shine Diamond. Still not a bad name compared to some localized names, but I mean, I guess it means I like to repair stuff because I'm like a kind guy. But I don't really know about the violence thing. I don't really like to beat people. I'm not. I'm not really brutal like Josuke. I guess I don't know. It might have been, but. Yeah, I, that is my stand. If you guys want to have a go at this quiz, uh, make sure you check the link down below. The link, the first link, in should be to this page. And I think the next couple of quizzes I'm going to do is also be ones like this. Maybe like which judge villain are you, or which judge character are you. And then I might even do this series is crazy and blah blah blah. You know, what? I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna bookmark this so I can go to back to this page and do these other quizzes here. Let me know what stand you got down below if you're taking this quiz, and if not, you know, as I said, click the link, have a go yourself, let me know. Thank you for watching, if you've enjoyed, make sure you leave a big old like, subscribe if you're new, ring that bell, or muda muda that bell, and I and the beast have a dream, and my dream is to catch you all next video. Keep rolling, peace out.